Oh, I let's don't tell them that whether I won, lost, or drew, or whatever they. In that way, it's more like a story. I don't know which one. Let me see. Oh, this is the same game. Let's see. That's round six. Um. Okay, well, let's do this one. Because I have s s some bad play, lots of bad play. You didn't make a mistake until move three. <laughs> this game, right. I just suffered and suffered, but I'm not going to tell you the outcome. It okay, was, Karen's was white bad. It was and her opponent is black. Horrible, horrible. Did not play very well at all. Now, Karen let go of a piece here by accident as she was moving it. So she was she's trying to play C4, and she let go by accident, so she had to play C3. Is that a good excuse? <laughs> no. Yeah, C3 doesn't make a lot of sense. So, yeah, in this position, you can play C4, or more mm -hmm. likely, Knight C3. I wish I'd played C4. I was going to go C... Knight C3 uh, and then D2 E4. And yeah, then, Knight C3 is the best. I know, I'm trying to tell you what I was wanting mm -hmm. to do. I want to go Knight D2 and then, and then Knight C4. I understand mm -hmm. that's not the best, but that's why I didn't yeah. need to You can't that. play Knight D2 because you hang that. Right. So you'd have to play something else. Usually if you want to play Knight D2, you go here, mm -hmm. and then later the other Knight goes to D2 to C4. Damn. I don't play anyway, this. Knight C3 is the this most is, common. This is why I don't like to. I need to look at this up anymore. Spencer and I have talked about it, but I just couldn't remember what to do. Mm -hmm. I know that D, pushing D5 is the best. He says you guys looked at Knight C3. I couldn't remember because it's been a while. She is two-thirds correct with C3. Um, I just couldn't remember. Okay, then E6. Now the engine wants you to play C4. Very suspicious. Yeah. They got to look at that opening again. The Lazo always likes to play that too. <laughs> so far, so good. It's a London with this pawn and this pawn missing. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the game was just terrible. She I was just good so far. Struggle. No, it was just struggle, struggle at some point. Engine wants you to go here and says equal. And this was a really long game, too. You heard me? Mm -hmm. Yeah, you played here, too passive. Then it says you resign. No, it says it's still equal. 97. Castles. Wants you to play bishop h2. Then you can play e4 because the bishop's not hanging. Mm -hmm. Then you play for e4. Okay. Game. Okay, so you castled. It still says it's about equal. Yeah, I just don't, I don't know enough about c5. I need to look at that more than I have. I just couldn't remember. Wants you to play knight h2. Although I might play knight e1. Knight e1 says it's slightly worse. Mm -hmm. Now it says knight e5. We'll never know which one. Probably this one. The engine wants you to play f3, but you correctly played f4 because never play f3. <laughs> now the engine doesn't take on passant and says f4 is bad. It just moves the knight back and then blocks your bishop. But he took on passant. So that was good. You avoided playing f3. Good mm -hmm. job. <laughs> now it says it's equal. Yeah. This whole game was stressful. Thanks, Thank Divinus. Thank you, Divinus. Divinus. Mm -hmm. This was just a yeah. And once you take with the bishop, because then this pawn's weak. And then put this knight on d3. Okay. I wasn't sure how to take. Bishop d3. Still equal. Mm -hmm. This game's the most equal. It says this move's terrible, and now you can play knight e5. I'm not sure why knight e5 is so good, but it really likes white there. Hmm. I, I, yeah. Oh, I know, because you, you win a pawn by some crazy trick. All right, knight e5 actually wins material. Oh, let me see. Because if he takes it, then mm -hmm. you take this. Mm -hmm. Then he takes, you take, he takes, you play check. 
and he can't block with the knight because his queen's hanging. Okay. So now you take this and you're a pawn up. Oh, I see. You all want me to see that. <laughs> it's nice to know it's there, though. Yeah, so now you five, it says you're plus 2.2. .2. Oh, that was pretty cool. I didn't see so that. So you played queen c2. Then they traded. Now it says you're slightly worse. And then which round is this? We should tell them what round. Can't tell them. They might look it up and see how you did. Oh, that's true. Yeah, because we're not going in order. We're just mm -hmm. skipping around. Mm -hmm. Bishop f2 is too passive. Don't play so passive. So if you're not going to play passive, play rook d1. Mm -hmm. And the engine wants you to play e4 and says you're better. Mm -hmm. Go okay. e4. Rawr. I can't go anymore. Yeah, I was just trying to avoid any checks. Uh, I know it's passive. Let's see what it is. That says you're slightly worse. Queen b1, too passive. Wants you to play e4. Get rid of your isolated pawn if you can. Rook d7 is legal. Rook d2. Wants you to play e4 every move. Here too. Knight a5. I guess wants to play knight c4. Now wants you to play e4. You played a3. Anti-positional. Weakening your white scores. I thought when he went here he wanted to go here, but he played knight b3. Thanks, Carter. Too tired to taco. Mm -hmm. What? You played f6. Boo, boo. <laughs> yeah, Candidate starts Friday. We're doing live coverage. Me, Spencer, and Karen. Especially Karen. There's a day that I can't do coverage because of jury duty, so that I won't be there. <laughs> duty. Okay, rookie two. <laughs> C4 is explosive. Still equal. Now wants you to play E4. Knight D4. Knight C5 is a good move. Rook F1 is the best move. Queen H5 is legal. Queen C2 is good. This was all horrible. I was just so stressed out. Bishop takes D4. I don't know about that move. The engine says that gives away a lot of his advantage. Mm -hmm. Now he should go here, but he plays. I was this. happy because then that pawn wasn't right. weak anymore. This says Bishop G3 equal. But you went back here. Too passive. Rook takes, queen takes. Bishop d2 wants you to come out here. Now it says you lose right away because of queen e2, pinning your bishop. Mm -hmm. But he played rook e7, also good. Then you played b3, and he played rook e2. Now it says you should resign. Oh, listen, I was just like, it was a horrible it says, situation. It says you resign is correct. <laughs> You played queen d1, that's the best move. Yeah. Then you played <clears throat> rook f3, that's the best move. Mm -hmm. Now, what he should do, it says knight a1, but I was not sure what he actually did. Knight a1. What? I moved his knight. I guess it's e1. Yeah. Yeah, but you wrote a1. Close. Here's okay. what he should do. Knight f4. Mm -hmm. That if you take with the rook, it's mate. If you take with the bishop, you lose your queen. Mm -hmm. And then if you don't do anything, this pawn's hanging. Or it takes g2 check. So it says he's plus eight. Mm. It says you have to give your queen away and lose. So he played knight e1. And then you played the excellent rook f2. Now it says you're slightly worse. So 91 threw away all of his advantage. I was just so relieved. Mm -hmm. It's like, man, okay, I escaped death somehow. Now it says you're better. It wants you to play queen here attacking this D pawn mm -hmm. with check. So you took this, also good. He threw in this check, that's right. You put it in H. Then you put it in H again. That was good. Tricked him. <clears throat> All right. The f Thanks for the $3, Karamja local. Yay. Okay. The first person who guesses what Black did here 
gets a free sub. <laughs> and it, you have one minute. If the move isn't in chat in a minute, nobody wins. First person that guesses Black's move gets a free sub. I think I know what the move is. I'm not even sure that I remember it, but I think I know what it is. But I'm not going to give a hint. And you can only guess once. Whose turn it is is correct. Black's turn. What did Black do? You only get one guess. The hint is I'm giving a sub away for it, so it's not a movie you would consider. They're not going to get it. No. <laughs> I didn't do the greatest, and Ben didn't even play. Ben was working. This move isn't terrible. It's just a move you would never think of. But um, Nobody I, would consider this move, so it's hard to play it. I did gain 26 points. Hey, somebody got it. Yeah. I Am Snow Burrito is correct. Give that man a sub. I can't find his name, but it's somewhere here. You win a sub for right suggesting here? the strangest move. Yeah, he got oh, it right. Got it, yeah, yeah, that was. Possible. I thought I wasn't. Gonna, I thought that wasn't going to cost me anything. I thought nobody's going to get it. <laughs> I am Snow Burrito. He did it. I wasn't sure why he went back. Queen F8. God damn. Oh, unless it, he was going to come in on the other. There's nothing pawn. wrong with the move, but it's not a move you would think of. No, I agree. He's attacking the pawn. It's like if an engine, he's attacking the A3 pawn. I didn't even notice that. Yeah, that's the only thing I can think of. Queen F8. I was like, in the game, I was like, what is going on? And then that was. What, like, somebody else got it right? Roberts SWA? I didn't see I that. I was so relieved he got out of my face. I was like, thank God. It was oh, well, too bad, Robert. Horrible. Yeah, Robert said Queen F8. Also, I am Snow Burrito guessed some other move. So he cheated. And he guessed it after Robert SWA. Oh, so who? So he cheated by guessing more than one move, and he got it second. And so I, I did really bad. So you gave the sub to the wrong person? Oh, yeah. Aww. He suggested more than one move. I'm giving, he, it, I'm giving one to Robert, Okay, too. it's all right, but we're not mad at uh, Snow. Yeah, whatever. you can't guess more. Yeah. Robert <laughs> also guessed twice. Oh, you all cheated. It's fine, Snow Burrito. Well, every, everybody cheated by guessing more but than once. But you guys, you know, come on now. Don't be bilking the system. Anyway, Queen F8. Didn't see that one. Or did you already take care of the... Everybody got a sub. Now it wants okay. you to play Queen G4. Okay. That way if he takes on H6, you can come in here, check. Mm -hmm. But you played the most passive move on the board. What did you play? I don't remember. What's the most passive move on the board? I don't remember. I, I know, but here, I'm, look at it and then I find the most passive. I don't know. I'm, you're going to need to tell me what. You can find the most passive. No. Move. Bishop C1. All right. Boo. <laughs> okay, then he checked and you saw it. Then he went back. He went back? No. No. For Queen G3. I didn't want to lose the pawn. Queen. And that was. Something 2. And I was hoping he would take it with his knife. Looks like Queen A2. I guess it's Queen E2 threatening mate. Queen right. E8 mate. That's right. All right. So he saw it. It isn't he, actually. Then Queen G6. Then Queen back to D1. Yeah, just move your bishop. Mm -hmm. Keep your queen on the open line. Queen B6, Queen C2. Then you played Queen here again threatening mate. Queen B5. That's a strange move. Now you're better, it says. Queen E6 trick. Yeah, I got out. I got Ooh. out. <laughs> now, you, now you're better. <laughs> yeah. And so I actually offered him a draw because I thought I had um, a perp. Yeah, don't, he, don't say anything about the game. Okay. Then they'll know the result. Uh, no, I wasn't going to say anything further, but that's fine to say that. That's right. what I thought. Mm -hmm. You tell me afterwards. Yeah. It's, you know, not that exciting of a conclusion. Queen d7. Bishop g5 check. King c8. Now it says you're better. Wants you to go here. You played this. That's good. Now king b8, which is bad, and he should feel bad. It says bishop h5. You play bishop h4. That's a good typo. 
Queen A4, why defend your king when you can lose on purpose? <laughs> so in this position, black should play queen C7, so you can't play bishop G3. Right. And it says white slightly better. Now if king here, queen C7 made is good. I mean, the game was wrong. This is like a five-hour game, too. So he was tired as well. And then I thought you were going to play this mate, and you played this mate. Yeah. Yay. <laughs> so I won. Karen wins. <laughs> Who could that wasn't imagine that bad. it? That wasn't that bad. It was Spencer bad. likes your move better. <laughs> I didn't think it was that bad. I, that that game was so stressful. Um, he was fifteen seventy something. Yeah, I won. <laughs> but that was a stressful game. I was just defending and defending. I, well, I, got, I got rid of the variation. Darn. Find myself in those situations. I got rid of it by accident. Crap. Now I have to do it all over crap again. Crap way that I play. I, I did wanna, beat I, him, though. You keep talking to them while I do this. You got rid of some variation. I got rid of, like, the whole most of the game. Oh. I clicked on the wrong thing. Oh, you're so fast. Right. But, um... Yeah, so I was really happy I beat this guy. I did. I grind, grinded him down. I, he just, once he let me out, I felt so relieved because I felt like I was either going to perpet, perpetual or just keep attacking. I didn't, I, you know, I wasn't completely sure what would happen, but I thought that um, I had the initiative at that point and that um, he would have to move two or three times to get his attack going again. So yay, I won. <laughs> I played so much chess, it was so tiring. Mm. Oh wait, you still didn't play that. No, I didn't. <laughs> He was shaking. He was shaking. I could tell he was wondering if I saw the mate. All right, now <laughs> we can analyze this game. I don't think you played that badly at all. You made like five bad moves in 60. It That's was all right. what was bad. And that game was a five-hour game. It was a five-hour but me just constantly having to always be in that position where I'm defending these weak pawns. And I can't get my own attack going. This happens to me almost all my games. But I, gotta, I, I did win. I got to do stuff, like send you that, because you didn't put it in your computer yet, right? Right. Yeah, that's true. Thank you for remembering that. Yay. Mm. <laughs> that's true, Wally. Wally and I have played over the board. And even though I was down the exchange, yeah, I play on. <laughs> Should I send it to Karen or KB? KB. It really doesn't matter, though. Karen wins. Yeah, so for this game, I mean, I was just stressed out, but I just thought, well, I can probably, you know, maybe draw this game. Even even when he brought his attack in and I knew that I was in huge trouble, he wasn't able to make anything of it because we were both so tired. Oh, it's almost done. That last, you know, percent though always takes forever. Yeah. Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> I was so tired. And then after the tournament, we went out and, and played poker at the win. We went downtown and, and Ben played a tiny bit of blackjack. We ate and we played poker at the win till 2 in the morning. She put the win in win. And I won. When I told Karen she we're going to the win, can you get directions? She w typed into her phone, like on Lyft, and she said, it doesn't say that casino exists. And I'm like, what are you talking about? So then I looked at her phone, and she typed in N-G-U-Y-E-N. I was like, no, not that win. That was a long, complicated joke that they didn't get. Yeah. I was so happy with my last hand there. She called with sixes. The, the, the board had ace, king, eight, and two rags. 
And the guy bet like 75 bucks. And she said, I call bitch. I knew he was bullshit. And she didn't say, I call, I hope I'm winning. She's like, I call bitch. <laughs> Sixes, ship it. I knew he was bullshit I, because he was, he didn't, his whole behavior the whole way was, and he likes to bluff a lot, was like he didn't have anything. Then an ace came on the river, mm -hmm. and all of a sudden now he's, you know, I'm not going to say the ugly thing that I said it in Las Vegas, but he, big dick in it, and mm -hmm. acting like, oh, let me put $75 out, and I just called it. I'm like, Bring that reminds it. me of a hand I played in Detroit. I didn't tell her this he about 30 anything. years ago. Listen to this hand. Sorry I about the ugly language. There was a guy who was raising a lot. <laughs> yes. So I'm in a hand with him, and I have a pair of twos. Mm -hmm. That's my, I mean, I have twos. Okay. So the board comes. I'm the only caller before the flop. He bets, I call. The turn comes. He bets, I call. The river comes. He bets, I call. And when I called, I said, I call. Twos, ship it. <laughs> So if he, he has like any two cards he wins and he knocked. <laughs> Everybody's like, how did you know you won? I said, two is ship it. I said, ship it. And they gave, and they gave me the money. That's so funny. Yeah, because he was always betting. So I was like, hey, he's got two cards. I'm the slight favorite. Very slight. <laughs> slight. Anyway. I'm not even sure I'm a favorite against they pra him. They praised my play at the table. I knew, I knew he was bullshitting. I knew he didn't have anything. Yeah, I won that hand. I won a bunch of, that was a big pot. I too. lost 100 to Ben at the Westgate. Oh, okay, now I know who you are. You're Test Dojo guy. He played on our team when we won. Wait, now who? Yeah, was... I had him out kicked. Wait, Nordovic was in the tournament? He, he, he's, the, he's the guy who's on our team. Uh, he played poker with me, and, and you were at the other table the first night okay. we played. Okay. Yeah, I remember. I remember. He knows me from Michigan from before you were yeah, born. Yeah, I remember him. Yeah. 